Hello y'all, how's it going? <laughs> we gotta have a, the first Isabel vs. Rob matchup of all time. Maybe the greatest, maybe the greatest dude I ever do it. Uh, I think this matchup's a pretty zoner based matchup. Generally what you're gonna wanna do... Hold on, let me put my Twitter on here, I'm trying to get some clout. I apologize y'all. No, my name! Does it not want me to be catalyzed? Alright, we got a GP here. It's actually a pretty even game right now. Uh, it's slight lead for Rob, but you have to always factor in the weights. 60% for Isabel is not 60% for Rob. It, it's mostly about the combo percentages. At this point, Isabel is going to be, uh, Rob's going to be looking mostly for a kill, and Isabel is mostly trying to extend her combos, get him to around 150, where you can get a pretty consistent kill setup, maybe 130 even. Uh, right now you're above, but Isabel, Isabel's landing options aren't great, but you can always fade off stage. Her recovery is really good if you're able to maneuver it properly, but you have to always be ready for that down air. Those down air shenanigans, you just don't want to be sent down to the Shadow Realm. Big push. Oh, she got the laser. No, big laser. Oh, she got the top. Wait, what kind of what kind of what kind of controller? Oh yeah, don't worry, that's fine. Big air. Oh, she had the she had the top in the bag now. All right. Make up in the sky. Now you you still don't have the stock advantage, but there's so much time on the clock to play with that you can afford to be pretty defensive. Yeah, you want to hop on comms? Oh, you get on that chair. Here you go. What's your Twitter? What's your name? We gotta get you on here. Oh. Yeah, let me get you in. No, I'm joking. Yeah. No, it doesn't, but... Uh, no, I'm sorry, I'm... I think Wall is glitter. All right, we got it. We got it in here. Rob down throw. This should be a kill if he gets the read. Not yet, I think... What time do you think... What percent do you think up throw kills? Down the up air? Yeah. Which one, Rob up air? Or yeah, Rob up air. Rob up air? I think it depends. This is probably around kill percent with good DI, depending on the stage. Ooh, but it is definitely B. kill percent to side B. Yeah, that was Absolutely. a good side B too, because I don't think out of shield Isabel could have had the craziest punish at that percent. Sure. Maybe like a solid 30%, and then Rob at 70 isn't something to be super afraid of. Yeah, I feel like the best you could do is a, is a grab into something, and at, at that point of the ledge, I don't know what you get. Yeah, and then Rob's like landing there is so good, because I think it destroys the pellets, doesn't it? Mm. Honestly, I, I feel like this matchup can't be all that good. Yeah, uh, I was going to say can't be all that good, but that's incredible. I oh. forgot about that. Yeah. Cause, Cause Isabel can force out the top too. Can you get a? I don't think you can get another one if it's in the bag. I think so, that is true. So you kind of you're forced to play with lasers, and then and even so, you can still take that laser, and it's it's really threatening to be able to use that back against Rob. Yeah. Um, on top of that, though, I, I gotta say the side B. I feel like it's a great option in this matchup if you're Rob. Yeah, cause it, it's a it's the, got an okay reflector. But it's like a bit inconsistent, like, but if it hits, it hits, and if it doesn't, I think also like seems pretty good at ledge in a lot of cases. Oh yeah, cause you catch, you can't roll. I think it's like the thing is the risk reward here for Rob when you get in is so low, cause you're just so yeah. much heavier. That's true. Uh, <laughs> Plus, I mean, Rob's got like options for everything, you know. So I mean, I noticed he's been doing that. Quite yeah, a lot. that side be off the ledge was just. And the thing is, like, even though that option, if you if you pick the option to get around that option and you like read it, you're gonna take like a really big punish, right? But at the same time. You gotta find a way to make your opponent respect it. So if you keep on going for it, you know sometimes it's fine. You, you keep swinging that side B until until you know, until, it, very clear. until it's just it's such a good panic option a lot of the time. You can just always like you can always just throw it out. I think pretty safely. Uh, uh, it's, I it's think it's not I think very it's, safe. It's matchup dependent. Because most cases. characters can F smash it out of shield with a yeah. little charge. I think it's also like side dependent. When you're um, doing it in someone on ledge, they're not really gonna be behind you. I think. Eh. It so, depends. It depends. You yeah. have to space it well, I think. Yeah, this is a huge you have thing. to be but careful. But then again, I feel like a, a very common option is jump uh, off of ledge, especially at like a, a like okay, competitive like level, you know? 100% if you have like a, a hard read on the timing, maybe. Maybe. Yeah, because uh, a lot of the time... Rob moment, Rob moment. 40 down tilts. Oh <laughs> no, the down to the blender! <laughs> They'll go to the corner, get out! That is, that is very Rob. <laughs> 
Yeah. Oh, and dead. Oh. Yeah, he was very, very smart. He waited for the pocket. Oh, but never mind. <laughs> never mind. No longer smart. He died. You died for it. <laughs> Listen, in the pursuit of sauce, you're meant to go for anything you can. True, 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 true. Absolutely. Even though it, had, it, <laughs> it, was, it, it did net him a kill, but he was at like zero. <laughs> he could have made it back, right? What did you say? Was, was he in lag, you think? Oh, another oh, one. Yeah, never mind. Come back, come back, come back. Oh, my goodness. No. <laughs> that I've never seen Rob move so quickly like that. He, like, he just teleports. Yeah. Is it fighting back? Yeah. It's funny, kind of how that backer just launches. It's oh, my oh, gosh. Shadow Realm. Yeah. That is a scary, scary thing, especially. I mean, if you're Isabel, you're you're kind of defenseless while you're going for that recovery. So the best thing you can do is just kind of hope that your drift is enough to not get yeah. hit by it. Yeah, I think I think also you can generally like if you're above ledge, you can always mix it up really easy. But yeah. below ledge, you just have to like it's kind of like uh, a weaker version of Robs because mm. you can't go down as easily. Oh, oh, uh, get almost had for it for a second there. <laughs> almost had the super blender. Yeah. All right, and the following up around the platform. No, nothing coming of it though. Nice, nice job getting off the platform by Sheep. Yeah. No, I feel like getting off the platform against Rob is so hard. So the fact that you're able it's to. It's so do scary because there's like a very, very small amount of time where you're safe, you know. Yeah, and then you're always afraid of either like uh, short hop up air or up tilt or even just a yeah. raw up smash if they hard read it. Oh, big nair, get him off. Yeah, like a lot of. Oh, I like that. That managed to somehow duck the uh, the laser. That's wild. Yeah, I think hitbox manipulation is so interesting in this oh, game. Like I think um. A lot of clouds now do. Ooh, that's, that's very big strong. backer. That's yeah, it. I think just yeah. enough rage to kill too. Yeah, it's all it said, but Rob is just. Yeah. That's that's what we call in the business the zombie. 